video I am on the floor because I have about 10 12 bags of items that I purchased at the Plato's Closet sale this past weekend. Um, I was in these streets. I'm, I'm aiming to get my numbers up. And so um, this is just the way that I'm doing it. I'm going to as many sales as I can to get my numbers as close to a thousand as I can, as well as managing life and going to events and really working on my blog. And so, you know, reselling is a part of my financial plan and so i have to make sure that poshmark is set and so once again we went to or not we i went to plato's and so now it's time for us to go through the haul together because some of the stuff i got and i don't remember getting it <laughs> sometimes you're just in the zone um so the first piece that i got i actually got this at goodwill i made a stop at goodwill because plato's wasn't open yet and there was a Goodwill really close by. And so when I picked this up, I was like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. This is a Brighton Faux Croc Embossed bag. Um, and I love Croc Embossed. Like my Brahmin bag is a pink, my thrifting bag. You guys have seen it many a time. Um, but um, it's Croc Embossed and I love it. It takes all the lick and it keeps on ticking. It's actually the bag that I take to the bins. And so Brahmin and, um, and Brighton, they just make some really good and expensive bags and so one day i will be coming on here with my hermes crop bag trust and believe but until then we're sticking to brahmin and um brighton so this is the first bag i'm gonna throw it which is so disrespectful so disrespectful all right so let's back up a little bit and let's get into this haul so now the thing with play-doh let's 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 do a disclaimer let's talk about that the thing with play-doh is that we know that it is a brand um, a store brand, a retail brand, brick and mortar that is geared towards a younger demographic. And so I would say probably 18 to 30 because they do carry Zara, they do carry some professional wear, they do carry blazers and pencil skirts and, you know, some of the higher end denim lines. And so when you're shopping for Poshmark, think about, you know, who's coming to the app. Right. And so I definitely got and working on getting more plus size and more size 10 to 12, but I can't leave that Poshmark customer out. And Play-Doh's is that Poshmark customer. So let's get into the let's get into what I purchased. Some of this I've already listed because I wanted to get started on listing. My goal is to list 100 items this week. I want to be that reseller that lists 100 items a day. But I'm like, how can I list 100 items, take pictures for the blog? go to events, cook dinner, <laughs> have sex with my husband. How can I do all that and do 100 listens a day? Um, TMI, I know. I'm sorry if there are any kids watching. Forgive me. Um, but how can I be a wife, a mom, a blogger, a vlogger, and a reseller and do 100 items a day? I'm working on it. Let's get to the haul. So first things first, free people. I know um, that there have been resellers that have not been able to shift free people. For me, you guys know that I'm working on just featuring items that I like. Number one, because I want my Poshmark closet to be a reflection of who, my, who I am and my style. And I've learned that if I don't like it, I'm not going to list it. I love the colors on this. I love the purple. I love the orange. I love the green. It goes with my lip. Um, I love the sweater. To me, you know, <laughs> you put this on with a green pant, darling. And everything just comes together. So that's why I got this Free People sweater. It, because it's Free People, can, and I still believe in the brand, um, and because I love the colorways. I'm just going to do this bag by bag. And I'm, it's going to be a lengthy video, okay? I'm chatty. I'm a chatty Kathy. You guys know this. All right. So the next piece is this French Connection. Now it's French Connection because I just listed it. This French Connection dress. Now, one thing with Play-Dohs is that there are a lot of twos and fours and sixes. I tried my best to get into the higher range of the size spectrum. This indeed is a two, but once again, we're talking about that Poshmark customer, right? So um, size two French Connection. French Connection and Club Monaco, I feel like are really good brands for Poshmark. Karen Millen, that Karen Millen skirt that I purchased um, for resale, that has already sold so and that was a size two so the size two customer is there this no this is old this is old but i listed it yesterday that's why it ended up in this pile this is this is a forever 21 plus 
top. Once again, Forever 21, you know, it's a fast fashion brand, but if you treat it well, it will last you. So this is a size 1X, and I love it because I love the colors on it. Is it a 1X or a 2X? It's a 1X. It's a 1X. But it's a flowy top, and I know you guys are saying, Dion, it's January. Let me tell you something about this global warming, y'all. It's snowy one day in the 60s in the other. All of my friends that are in Chicago are just like, Dion, we have no idea what's going on with this weather. Well, my girlfriend said she sent me a picture, and um, she was she was wearing just a, a thick sweater, a, a skirt, some opaque tights and boots. And I was like, girl, where's your coat? She's like, coat for what? Goodbye. I was like, what? In January in Chicago? Hmm. So I'm I'm getting spring, summer stuff quite early. And that's what the sale is good for, especially in South Florida. So I got these AG's Distressed Denims. Denims. Denim. Um, I love AG as a brand. AG sells for me. This is a... A different kind of cut the skinny legging is the one that I tend to go with when I'm selling in my store and so I got these and I like the splattered paint that's really what kind of drew them to me and you know I'm gonna buy what I would wear and this is something I would totally wear I love the undone hem you guys have seen this in my style videos when I'm styling myself I love this I love the undone hem and how it falls over the bare foot it just to me it's really sexy it's like toe cleavage I love toe cleavage so I got that and then I got this, oh Lord, why did I get this? What is this? Do I even know how to, how do I, how does this go? Okay, hold on. This is MMG. <laughs> I got it because I like the print. Um, it's a skirt. And I'm going to figure out how to put this on the mannequin. Haven't listed it yet, but it's a skirt. And I got it because I loved the pattern. That's what I loved on that. And then I got this purse. I, when I picked up this purse, I thought it was B. Mikowski, and I literally just kind of threw it in my pile because I like the leather. I don't even know who this is. Um, who is this? Vince Camuto. Okay. Does Vince Camuto make bags? I didn't know that. Okay. So, Vince Camuto, it's really, oh my gosh. No, Dion, don't fall in love with it. Do you see this orange? I don't have anything like this in my closet, y'all. See this burnt orange goodness? I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna sell it. I've never seen this color before. And that's why that's why I picked it up and threw it in the pile. I didn't even know who it was. I thought it was B. Mikowski. But I saw this little tassel. I'm like, that's not B. Mikowski, but I'll figure it out later. But um hmm. I like that. Okay. I like that. All right, so that's one bag. Oh, how many minutes was that? Eight minutes. Okay, do I need to do part one and two? Oh, Lord. Stop chatting, Dion, and get through the hall. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We'll see where we're at when we get to the 30-minute 30, 30 mark. It may be a two-part haul. All right, so I got this bag. This is a faux leather bag. This is brash, trash, something. But I love the fringe. I'm all about a fringe right now. And so I got this because of the fringe. And that's really it. I love it because of the fringe. Um, these shorts. Okay. So Forever 21, we know this is a tiny, teeny, tiny person. But what a beautiful, beautiful color. And so that's why I bought these shorts for that girl. Another thing I want to tell you about buying summer items or buying items that are summerish right now. It's cruise season um, across the globe. And so although it's winter in many parts of the globe, it is um, cruise season. So a lot of people are going on cruises between now and March. In South Florida, we know that because we're in South Florida and a lot of our ports are cruise ports. Um, so it's cruise season. So don't neglect that customer who may be coming to your closet to shop for a cruise. This is a Charlotte Russe. And I got this because, again, I love the color. I wasn't a fan of this color block, but I could see how someone could love it. And so I like it. I didn't love it, love it, love it, but I saw how someone could love it. And I love the, the color is just, you guys see I'm all about this coral kind of color. Um, this is a boohoo. Is this boohoo? Um, is this boohoo? This is Good Times USA. I got this 
because look at this armhole. I think that's so sexy. So this is just a bodycon, but look at the armhole. The armhole is super sexy. Um, just a bodycon, and I love details like this on bodycons. Um, it just is super sexy to me. So I love this. This is very like Zoe Kravitz. I could see her wearing something like this. Bodycon with low arm, maybe a little side boob coming out if that's you. <laughs> I say that because I am jealous. Whenever I go on to um, uh, fashionnova.com and look at their plus size, I'm like, who is this size 3X that does not have to wear a bra that is just out here <laughs> with side boob? I was looking at swimsuits for my birthday and I was like, my body's not, I'm not going to look like that in that bathing suit. There's going to be a whole lot of body coming out of that side. Um, <laughs> but if that's you, girl, you do that. All right. So here is going to do a lot of steaming. This is has Marshalls, has the Marshalls brand on. It's just a peasant top. Once again, I love the color and I love the front. I love that. It's cute. Cutie, cutie, cutie. The trumpet sleeve. All right. And then this is a bodysuit. With bodysuits, you want to make sure that the crotch is okay. And I did. And this is by Nasty Gal. And so a little camisole, something that any girl can kind of wear under her blazer. So that's bag number two. Let's put that in there and move to the next bag. All right. Uh, the, a few of these pieces have already been listed. This has been listed. This is something I would totally wear. It's a bar three faux leather dress. If you follow me on Instagram and looked at my stories and you've seen this, I put this on my stories. Um, and I mean, it's self-explanatory. Look at the back, look at the front. Um, this is just, this is something I would wear if it was in my size for my birthday dinner. Where that birthday dinner is, I don't know because my husband doesn't like to tell me these things. Um, <laughs> so I don't know what I will be wearing for my birthday dinner, but I'm sure there's something in my closet or I'll just thrift something. All right. So this I totally got for myself, but it's not going to fit my girls. This is Forever 21. This is the size 2X. Love, love, love this dress. Look at the neckline. Look at the neckline, guys. Isn't that pretty? Look at that color. Oh, Valentine's Day. You know, my husband catches it on both sides because my birthday is right before Valentine's Day. So I'm like, you got to come through. To Whoa, Christmas, New Year's, birthday, Valentine's Day. He got to come out that pocket four times. And New Year's because, you know, I need a New Year's outfit and I need to go somewhere. So he got to come out that pocket four times before March. <laughs> All right. I love a good romper. I love a good romper. This is Band of Gypsies, size small. This is a small, it's a small, but you know, that's who our girl is. Band of Gypsies, love this little romper. And so my goal, now that I'm, now that I've gone to Play-Dohs and kind of just gotten a lot of the small sizes, now it's time to build up the mediums and the larges before spring rolls around. This is a nasty gal. This looks like a nasty gal top. So this is the top, y'all. This is the neck. This is the neckline. And I want y'all to peep the back. <laughs> this is that girl that ain't wearing no bra. Where's she going? Here's the back. So you can see the back. She ain't got on no bra. Or maybe she does. Maybe she has on a cute little black lace bra, but I love it. If I was that size, I would wear it. I ain't gonna lie to you. All right. Uh, let's see. This is a sequin. Now, I know we're not doing the holidays, but you know, you know, you know, if your birthday's coming up like mine is coming up, you might want to do a gold sequin. You might wanna. You might wanna. So I got that gold sequin jacket. This was another little dress that I was like, this is cute. TikTok, which is most more, more than likely a Junior's brand, but a little suede number there. I'm going to throw up my arms. Did I shave today? If I didn't shave, don't judge me, okay? <laughs> Forgive me. It's been a long weekend. All right. So here's just a faux suede dress. This dress, what was this? This is Zio. I really enjoy this dress. This to me is like a total like, did you see that movie? What's the movie I just saw with uh, J-Lo? When she was working in the supermarket, but then she got a job at the um, at the corporate office. This is totally her. <laughs> it's totally that girl. 
This is totally that corporate girl moving up the ladder, or even like Taraji in What Women Want, What Men Want, What Men Want, when she plays the uh, the sports, not recruiter, the sports agent. This is definitely her. And so that's where I got that cute little dress. And I love the leather detail. The leather detail is what got it for me. All right, so there's that. This is a skirt. And I remember the skirt because I'm like, this would be so cute to pattern mix. I don't know who makes it. Oh, yes, I do. Blue. Blue rain. Blue rain. But this is, oh, look at that. I don't know what size this is. Five, six, it says. Blue cult. Whatever it is. But look at that. That's such a cute skirt. And it's pretty wide. I love the pattern on that. Uh, let's see. This is Toby, I believe. I did find a lot of Toby, and I swore to myself I would not buy Toby ever again. But here I go buying Toby. I just need to price it properly. It's not. I don't price it right. I pri I price it high, but now I'm gonna price it the way it needs to be priced. Um, I'm not gonna play myself. So here's a little Toby top. There's that. Here is, is this Forever 21. No, this is a basic H&M. I've sold these before. I don't know if because they have like a cult following, but I have sold these before. Just the basic black bodycon long dresses. I think it's because um, our girls or our women rather will put it on underneath like a sweater or something. So I bought that. This, I feel like I've bought this before. I bought this at the Play-Doh. This is a BDG. I've bought this and sold this before in Chicago. It is a, uh, I don't know. I want to say that it's a top, but it very well may likely be a dress. One of those Urban Outfitter brands, uh, BDG. And so I'll put it on a mannequin and see, see how it flies. Oh my gosh. This is going to be a two-part video, guys. I'm just letting you know. Um, <laughs> it's going to be a two-part video. Um, this is, who is a Silence and Noise. And this is a size small as well. And it has, there we go. There we go. Silence and Noise. A little wrap, wrap front top. Wrap front, wrap back, wrap front, wrap something. On a mannequin, it'll all come together. This dress I really like. I really like. This is Miss 60. I really like this dress. This is racy. This is racy, guys. Miss 60. This is the back. This is the back, y'all. <laughs> That's the back, and that is the front. And so I got it because I thought that was super sexy. I think that's sexy. I think that's sexy. That's what you come to Poshmark for. Don't play with it. All right. So that's one bag. Woo, okay. So this bag is done. Uh, I have like seven more bags, guys. Not lying to you. Not kidding with you at all. All right. Who is this? What is this? Who is this? What is this? This is BDG. This I grabbed. This is like the last thing item that I grabbed. Um... This is a high-waisted pant, and I just liked it because I liked it. High-waisted, kind of mom jean. Kind of crop mom jean, I love that. Uh, what is this? Ooh, A, this, what is this? Zara, what did I do? Oh! Yeah, I like this dress. This is going up like now. This will probably be one of the first items I put up. Look at this dress. This Zara dress. This is a size medium. Look at this dress. Look at this dress. Look at the back. Isn't that cute? What a rich color. What a rich color. I didn't even check them out. Please, Lord, please have the buttons. Okay, yes. It has the buttons. Sometimes in these sales, you just grab stuff. And you're like, oh, wait, it's missing a button. Oh, it has a tear. I was really good this time at really, like, being, hold it, very, uh, not conscious. What's the word I'm looking for? Intent. Intent. And having intent. Intentional. Thank you, Holy Spirit. 
Um, very intentional in my purchases. So this, oh, look at the back, look at that. With the bow. This would have been great for the holidays, but even just for, oh, Valentine's Day. Look at that, look at that, my darlings. Look at that. Oh yeah, let me put that, let me throw that over there to make sure. I'm gonna list, my goal is to list, I told you guys 100 this week. If I could do 30 today, that would be absolutely amazing. I do have some, I hope you guys are liking like the pictures that I'm um, giving you guys on YouTube and Instagram and on my blog at DionDean.com. I'm being very intentional with my time and making sure that I get those up because I really do, I love taking those pictures. So this is, um, oh, Nanette Lepore. <laughs> I just picked it up because I liked it. Okay, okay, look at that, look at that, look at that. New attacks, what size are you? A size eight. Okay, Nanette, look at that. So pretty. Lord, don't let me get my lipstick on this. I will be wiping this makeup off probably <laughs> before I list any of this because the worst thing is to have or makeup on have makeup on your hands. And I put my hands on my face a lot, especially like if my husband calls during the day and we're talking and I'm just like. <laughs> All right, so here, here is that, Nanette Lepore. That's pretty. New tags. Okay, that's going up immediately. All of this stuff is going up immediately. I just need to process what's going on right now. Okay, so that's empty. Let's put this in here. All right, my loves. Okay. 21 minutes. All right. So here is a Madewell long sleeve top. It does have some wear, um, and so I'll price it accordingly. But, you know, it's Madewell. Madewell, right? So here's that. I love the lines in this. I absolutely love the lines in that. This is Diletta. I don't even know if Diletta sells. Oh, it has the friggin' sensor on it. <sighs> okay. Well, I'll be taking this back to get the sensor off of it. There's that. Uh, let's see. This has a stain on the inside. I don't know where that stain comes from, but it does have a stain. Don't know where that stain is from. But this is a beautiful pink bodycon. And who's the brand? This is Symphony. So there's that. <sighs> so pretty. This is misguided. Look at this, all of this like, all of this, like what you call it wear, Valentine's Day wear, isn't that pretty? To wear of a black dress, it's pretty. Put that over there, make sure it's what you call it. Okay, uh, this is DL1961, which does sell for me. I was very hesitant on getting white, but you know, if it's this there until the spring, it's this there until the spring. That's why we shop the sale. We get it for the price that we get it, right? So there's that. Okay. Let's put that there. All right. One more bag. And then I think, do I just go straight through? Let's just go. Let's, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Um, these, oh, look at these pants, y'all. Look at these pants. This is rehab, right? So look there. But then it has like split down here. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? I love that. That is so cool. So when you're walking, that pointed to, oh my gosh, with some Louboutins, y'all. Because you're walking and so the shoe is kicking up in the front, but it's also kind of flowing in the back. And you see that red bottom. Yas, 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 yas. All right. This top, this is totally a vacation top. This is, doesn't say, doesn't say who the brand is, but it's a total vacation top. Love that. And then these, who are these? These are liquor and poker. Never heard of this brand, but what I love is this big old gaping hole. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can hear my great aunt saying Dion. What is that? But this is somebody's jersey. Somebody this came like this, okay? So yeah, love that. 
And then last but not least in this bag, this is Forever 21. This is a very romantic dress. And I love crushed velvet for Valentine's Day. I absolutely love crushed velvet. So there is that. All right, speeding through those bags. Speeding through those bags. Let's put this over here. And then take this back to the store so they can take the sensor off of it. All right, all right. So let's go here. This is Banana Republic or Ann Taylor? I remember picking this up. Banana Republic. Um, this is a zero. I was hesitant to get this, but um, I feel like this customer is on posh. This is very like a Lily Pulitzer kind of situation, right? And so I got this for that customer. I like that. Very pretty. And then, who is this? They just have two in this bag. They make it seem like I got a lot of stuff. <laughs> These are Blank NYC. Blank NYC does sell for me. Um, price point probably like 15, 12, 15 bucks, but it does sell. And so when I get it, you know, that's an easy 12, 15 bucks, sometimes 20. On some of the like, like distressed, kind of like really cute styles, 15 or 20. All right. There is that, my darlings. Oh, it made it seem like there was a lot in that bag. There's only two pieces. So let's combine. Let's combine that. Oh, good. I don't feel like I have so much to list. I do, but it doesn't feel like it. What is this? This piece is over here. All right. So who, what, where? Oh, this brand. I I do buy who, what, where at... um. At Target, but a lot of it I get on Poshmark, to be honest, to be real with you, um, because we sell plus, our Target sells plus, but sometimes it's just a little too high. So sometimes you can find it on Poshmark. So between uh, Target clearance and Poshmark, I get my who, what, where. This is an extra large. I love this because of the arms. I don't know if you can kind of see how the arm placement is or how wide the arms get. And then look at the bottom portion, can you see that? Oh yeah, you can see right here. So the arm and then the skirt portion is why I purchased that. This is a dress, yes, no, maybe maybe so. This is a dress, and who is this dress by? This is a Toby dress, once again, I'm just gonna price accordingly. Toby. Very juniorish brand. This is, oh, I love this. This is the extra large. This is an extra large. Look at this. How am I going to merchandise this? Look at the top, but look at the bottom. It's very sexy. It's a romper. I'll figure out how to get it onto either the wall or I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll figure out how to do this, but that's an extra large. This is Boohoo. And the reason why I got this is because I like the cold shoulder. I don't wear a lot of cold shoulder, but remember this is posh. So, <laughs> so just a really sexy little black dress, LBD. Boohoo with the side cut out, showing your side meat. This is a romper, I believe. Is it a romper? Yes, it's a romper. And this romper, I don't know who it's by, but it's a romper. These floral rompers I like to have because this is this is the essence. This is this is a Florida girl for me. When I think about a Florida girl, I think about her. And then this, I just got this because it was sexy. This is Toby. This is a medium. I actually had a top, was it misguided? A dress that was the same. And it, it, people loved it on on my um on my posh. Now I was getting some low ball offers, and I was like, no, it was branded with tags. But this is, can you see that? That's how it, that's how it wears. Shoulder, and then this goes across the bust. So there's that. All right, three more bags. I think we'll be. I think we will make it to like 45 minutes. For those of you that love the long hauls, darling, this is for you. <laughs> this is for you, my loves. All right. Three more bags. I think we'll get to it, okay? All right. 
so what is this? What is this? What is this? Okay, this is a divided. Oh, I got this because it's just a simple faux wrap top. This is in a size two, but I feel like if you're a four, you could you could really fidget. Um, the arms little teeny, but it is it is cute. Just a faux wrap top, in a size two. Toby again. I'm just gonna price it accordingly. Let the chips fall where they may. It's a cute little. Cute little romper. Now I'm checking everything because I'm not going back to that store for just one thing. They didn't take the scents off. So there's that. This top, I could not. I was like, why did this not sell? Like, look at this. Look at the leather. It's a peasant top, but look at the. Can you see that? Can you see the leather in the front? Isn't that cute? BB top. So cute. This. Who is this? Uh, this was a cotton on, I think. I loved the, no, Love Culture. And so this is a medium. And what I liked about this was the bottom. I love that bottom on there. All right, who is this? This is H&M. Why am I buying H&M? <laughs> I got this because it was like a little peplum dress. I like that. I love little black dresses. So there's that. These jeans, I think these are these Aeropost style. No, Abercrombie and Fitch, which I don't really mess with too much. What I did like, though, is just like Frame Denim is really good at this. I'm not, I know there's other brands that do this. But Frame Denim did the crop with the hem and the flare. And so when I saw this, I thought about Frame Denim because they, they do it really well. So this is the Abercrombie, Abercrombie dupe to that frame. Oh, what's the, the flare? High La Flare, La High Flare, something like that. The frame denim. So that's why I picked that up, Abercrombie. And then we have this little naked dress by Pretty Little Thing. And so there's the back, but here's the front, guys. Here she is. Here's our Florida girl with a cutout front. <laughs> there she is. There's our posh girl. All right, two more bags. We got this. We got this. Ooh, what is this? This is Armani Exchange. I got this. I don't know why I got this. Yes, I do. I got this because I liked, I liked how thin it was. So it's not, I like, there are, are girls who have, and they wear their jeans like me or pants like me. They want a longer inseam. Um, and I'm, I'm that girl when it comes to black pants. If they're not wide leg, I like them long so that when I wear my heels, with black pants, they come all the way to the bottom. So that's why I got these, because the end seam is long. See how long that leg is? So yeah, Armani Exchange, which I've done a video on this. doesn't move for me like I'd want it to, but I think because of that, like not think, that's why I got it, because of that long end seam. Again, Toby, I just need to price her correctly. Scalloped bottom. There we go. And then this cute little top, mustard seed. Look at this little top. Look at this little top. Love that. I got this because of the stud. This is medium. I got this because of the studs um, at the top. Um, does anybody really wear the studs anymore? I think so. They wear them down here in South Florida, but you know our style is quite different than other parts of the world. Um, so this is very well maybe a Florida girl who just loves this kind of openness and the studs at the top. Love that. All right, all right, we're almost done. One more bag left. Who is this? This is Denim and Denim. Why did I get these? Oh, because they're a little bit of a flare. See that? A little bit of a flare. And flare is here to stay. High waist flare. Is that what it's actually called? Hold on, what is it actually called? Buka. So it's Buka, but to me it looks very flare. Is it Buka? Oh, maybe it is. All right, well. Buka it is, and Buka will be going up in the store. All right. Where did I get this? Who is this girl I'm shopping for? <laughs> this girl. This is Boohoo again. It's because I live in Florida. Because I know who this girl is. She lives next door. 
she see i see her at the mall chica lindas with this and and wear those jeans i just had the skinny jeans and a heel this is her aventura mall trust <laughs> And then this dress, this is by Topshop. This is going to be hard to show on camera, um, but it's just a wrap dress, a wrap dress. And I love Shop Top as a brand. It's very relevant, even though they've closed the American doors, all of the American doors, I believe. Um, it's still a very relevant brand. Let me put that over there to make sure that that gets, that gets listed right away. I thought I had more, but they just bagged like two things in the bag. Um... I oh, know I did have more actually. Let me put that in there. All right. All right. One more bag. Oh, we're going to make it. We are going to make it. We are going to make it. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. All right. This dress is by. Who are you by? Zara. Zara. Velvet dress why not i know you guys are like zara yes i got it only because i loved this i loved the velvet it's a wrap dress with a deep 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 v there's that we put that in the goes up today oh i'm tired y'all i'm tired i'm tired i'm tired who was this this was truve truve top which I know is sold at Nordstrom. I'm not sure if it's sold at other places, but Nordstrom is where I found Truve. You can see the top there. There's that. Um, BCBG. And this is a size four little black dress. So pretty little black dress. There's that. And then last but not least, I actually love this dress. This is a pretty little thing. This is a scuba dress that I really like. I didn't know why this was still on the racks. I feel like this would have been the first thing to go, but look at that. Oh, it's very first lady Obama, right? In her size, but very, very, very understated, but very sexy. It's scuba. Love this. Love this. All right. I really thought this was going to be an hour-long haul, guys, because you know I can talk. <laughs> but, um, yes, so that is it. Like I said, a lot of smaller sizes. Um, smalls, mediums. That's a chihuahua downstairs, so you're just going to hear. You're going to hear her. Um... A lot of smaller sizes, but it's relevant for my store. Um, there was a lot to choose from. I probably could have come home with double bags, but I just, I wanted to get stuff that I really liked. And so um, it was challenging, but I was able to do it. So, yep, that's it for the Play-Dohs haul. Um, I was thinking about going to TJ Maxx, but I don't think so. The last time I did the, because TJ Maxx, I don't know if you guys know, as well as Play-Dohs having their sales all, all across the country, TJ Maxx is doing their yellow clearance. I did the yellow clearance once and I feel like that stuff just sat in my closet. Um, I just got it because it was cheap. I didn't get it because I liked it. I'm going to go through the store and if there are pieces that I like that are yellow clearance, then I will invest. But other than that, um, I'm not quite sure that's where I want to put my money. So we'll see how that ends up. Okay, time to go list, guys. Time to go and um, get this money. Get the shmoney, I should say. All right, love you. We never pay retail. Of course, you can shop my Poshmark if any of this fits your vibe at uh, Dion Dean on Poshmark. Follow my Instagram at D I M Dion Dean. And of course, you can find all my fabulous looks that I put together on my website at DionDean.com. Love you. We never pay retail. Bye.